pop a top on a floating bar. Anytime that I can not pay $5 a beer in Washington, D.C., I'm, I'm up for it. It's BYOB on the brand new Potomac Paddle Pub. You can choose to sit still or cycle. It's a workout. I, I'm warm. It's like spin class, except there's alcohol and you're on a boat. There are 10 seats around the bar. You can stop at any point and your friends won't judge you as long as you pass another cold one. I mean, any time you can drink before noon on a boat is great. And I don't think I wore the right footwear. I have a heel on. This group of friends has best friends Jack Marr and Jack Walton to thank. Friends since they were two, they grew up in Arlington together, went to rival colleges, and now they are roommates and business owners at just 24 years old. We had a few drinks and we saw the trolley pubs. So we saw them in the street and just thought it would be a cool idea to do it on water instead. The buzz wore off and they stuck with the idea, even while sticking with their full-time jobs. That was in January. They found a boat manufacturer out in Oregon. Then we had to start getting in touch with the Coast Guard, the National Park Service, and the D.C. Harbor Patrol. There's a lot of people that have authority over the water here especially being in D.C. It's one of the most controlled waterways in the country. It's the city's first cycle boat. I am the designated driver of the boat. Jack and Jack teamed up with the Annapolis School of Seamanship for sober captains to steer. But these feet are helping the boat make a round trip from the Georgetown waterfront to Columbia Island Marina. There are 10 paddle stations. There's five on each side. And they all connect independently to one big crankshaft that turns the wheel behind me. So it's not dependent on everyone else paddling at the same time. Everyone can paddle at their own speed. And they do, taking frequent breaks to reach into the cooler on the 90 minute cruise. And you can get drunk on the sights. We're passing the Washington Monument, coming up next the Lincoln Memorial, and then going under the iconic Memorial Bridge. It's nice that it's a little smaller and you can usually Enjoy your sights around you. Seat move the wheel, and on a windy day, Joe picks up the throttle so the engine does more work. It's uh, a little bit more laborious than I was expecting, but you know, you can take breaks. So I guess that's the brilliance of having you know nine other people, your friends here, helping you out. The Potomac Paddle Pub will run until November 4th and then start again in April. Friends filled up the recycle bin on a Saturday morning. If DC is thirsty enough, you may see this boat in other nearby cities. For Chesapeake Bay Magazine's Bay Bulletin, I'm Cheryl Costello.